I'm sorry if I seem uninterested Or I'm not listening No, I'm indifferent Truly, I ain't got no business here But since my friends are here I just came to kick it But really, I would rather be at home All by myself, not in this room With people who don't even care about my well-being I don't dance, don't ask Hey, Sassy Squad, it's Sasha Today, I'm gonna be doing like a pink glowy valentine's day look i know i did one last week but this time like last week it was sultry this week it's like glowy and pink and it's really pretty and girly and yeah i really hope you guys like this video if you do anytime throughout give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're not already Comment below what you guys want to see next and without further ado let's get on with the video so I'm first going to be priming my eyes with my Eco Beauty um, Moisturizer. Putting it all over my face because in the cold you need this really badly. Now I'm going to be taking my Anastasia Brow Wiz pencils and just combing out my brows and making them on fleek. And please don't mind the acne I have because honestly it's just just don't mind it please I'm begging you <laughs> so yeah I'm just going to be filling in my eyebrows and doing what I gotta do I don't need a boyfriend so you can't go back please enjoy your party I'll be here somewhere in the corner under clouds of marijuana with this boy who's hot and I can hardly hear oh with this music I don't listen to and I don't so tell my friends that I'll be over here Oh, here Oh, here Oh, I ask myself what am I doing here Oh, here I'm now going to be taking my Maybelline Fit Me Stick And I don't use a foundation I only use this because it's very light And it gives me full coverage And it works perfectly on my skin So that's why I love it so much And a lot of people are using this too now Like before um, it was the Adri wand that was really popular, but we went back to this. Us, us girls went back to this, so that's what I'm going to be using. And also priming my eyelids with the same thing. Because I don't really feel like using something else, so I'll use the same thing to prime. Now I'm going to be using my Beauty Blender to blend it all out. taking my Maybelline Dream Matte Powder which is almost finished because I love it so much and I'm just going to be setting the concealer. Now I'm going to be taking the color Nooner from the Naked 3 palette and just buffing it into my crease and then I'm going to be taking that color. I forgot what it's called. Um, I'm going to be putting that in the crease too. Now I'm going to be taking the Morphe palette and using that sparkly pink color and putting it also in the crease because it should be a pink glowy look. Then I'm going to be taking that also very very sparkly pink color because this whole look is very sparkly and then I'm going to be taking that purpley kind of reddish color and putting it on my eyelids. It's not too pigmented and it's not too thick or not too extreme, but I'm putting that on my lids. And then I took that pink color and put it on my lids as well to make the whole look look more shimmery. And then I'm going to be taking that pink color <laughs> again and putting it on the lids. Then I used that white color to highlight because it's supposed to be glowy, it's supposed to be bright, the whole look pretty. That's what I'm basically going for, as you could tell. And then I'm going to be taking the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder and putting it on my T-zone or basically wherever I get oily. And yeah. And basically this is called Baking Your Face. And I say a little something right after this. And Need to wait 5 to 10 minutes. This is what Baking Your Face is. And if you want a separate video on how I do foundation, eyebrows, and everything like that, comment down below. So it now has been 5 to 10 minutes and I'm just lightly, lightly, as light as I can with a light, loose hand just brushing it off. 
with this very fluffy brush. And then that makes her face flawless. <laughs> setting that powder even though it is a powder it does have to be set so I set it with the dream powder again now I'm going to be um, doing a wing liner with this NYX really really cool liquid eyeliner and I go for wings again and of course my wing has to be on point so I'm very focused with this and it's surprising that I'm doing this on camera but in a minute, I messed up. Exactly. So I had to do that off camera. So then now I do my gel liner on the waterline. Now I'm curling my eyelashes. You get the gist. I'm now going to be taking my all-time favorite mascara. And this is the best I've ever used or I don't I have no idea what I'm saying right now but um yeah this is the best mascara I've ever used in my life I love it so much it's the new Maybelline mascara and it's so so beautiful pretty it elongates my lashes and it's so pretty I love it it's amazing <laughs> what else could I say so then now I take the um Tarte blush in expose and just put it on my cheeks to Make me look more pink and glowy and flirty and beautiful. So now I'm going to be taking my What's Up highlighter and highlighting my face because I want to be highlighted when the light hits me. We can break about the hit me if I seem a little unimpressed. And now I'm going to just be um, blending that in. And it is a two-in-one, so that's what I love about it so much that I don't need to use something else to blend it all in. So it has a sponge on the other side and I just blend it all in, as you could tell, yeah. <laughs> so now I'm gonna be taking the um, MAC highlighter in Soft and Gentle and just putting that on again. And here's the thing, I forgot to show you what I use for the contouring, but I will tell you in a minute. Now I'm gonna be using the Hoola Benefit Bronzer and just setting that contour in. And the thing was that my camera died as so I was doing the real contouring, but I used the Clinique Chubby Stick Contour Stick, so yeah. So I really hope you guys liked this video. If you did once again, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I always have my um, mailing address in the description, and it will be on the screen right here if you don't want to look at the description but I think you should because all of my social media is down there and if you want to like connect a little more with me or send me like personal things or letters or packages just a few ones then my mailing address is down below um and yeah comment down below what you guys want to see next and I will talk to you guys in my next video I love you so so much have a great Valentine's Day tomorrow and yeah, okay, bye. Mwah.